Marriage isn't a piece of cake. Woman asks for divorce just one day after wedding over cake prank. I mean, Christ, that's fast. However, don't do that. I've always considered that to be the lamest goddamn thing ever. Especially because it's not usually ever a mutual thing. It's always a seemingly a surprise for whoever's getting the cake shoved in their damn face. It just, it's a weird thing to do. We are truly living in the wildest timeline. There's something to be said about getting a 41 game suspension for gambling while being forced to wear a gambling ad on your own helmet every night. <laughs> Bet 99! Nuh uh. I have a systematic plan to infect Paris with bedbugs. Apparently, the Paris bedbug situation was done by some guy on 4chan on purpose, breeding them for months and making videos purposely releasing them on trains, hotels, and public areas he was in five months ago. Okay, so we're gonna like bury him, right? Well, come over. Gotta get dressed. We're gonna have to go on the back porch. Be my mom is in the basement right now. It's not hot out, so we good. Kick your mom out. Tell her you're the alpha male. Patrick, she's the sole breadwinner. That's not a good idea. Ah, smart guy. We don't talk enough about how stressful Halloween costumes are for the ADHD community. OMG, you people can't do anything. <laughs> I have ADHD. What the hell are you talking about? What does that mean? I'm so confused by that statement. We don't claim you as a real Jew. My last name is Bernstein. My great-grandparents emigrated from Poland to Brooklyn. I don't need to be claimed by a stranger on Instagram. Poland is like 90% Catholics, but I understand your point. What? They can't quite put their finger on it. Fans think something's missing after Dwayne Johnson's wax work was unveiled. Hmm. Did they make him white? <laughs> I'm pretty sure he said after this came out, he's like, hey, so you need to fix, first and foremost, my skin tone? It's missing a white t-shirt, a gold hoop earring, and a sign that says Mr. Clean. That too! Hi, excuse me, I just found out the professor for this online course I'm taking died in 2019, and he's technically still giving classes since he's literally my professor for this course, and I'm learning from lectures recorded before his passing. It's a great class, but what? Look, if it's something he was okay with and his family was okay with, fine. At least the school didn't own his likeness, do a <laughs> AI recreation of his ass like a lot of people are trying to do now, and dangling his dead corpse like that in front of you. I'm a black cop on the scene of a shooting one night, using a flashlight to look for bullet casings between houses to collect his evidence. Dispatch gets a call of a suspicious looking black male in police clothes using a flashlight to look into people's houses. <laughs> oh, oh, fuck. <laughs> My name is B. Hayes. I'm 18 years old, and I've been attending Nashville Christian School for 13 years. My senior prom was today, and I wasn't allowed in the doors because I was wearing a suit. I should not have to conform to femininity to attend my senior prom. I will not compromise who I am to fit in the box. Who are you to tell us what it means to be a woman? I do think that is some of the lamest <coughs> I've ever seen. Y you were wearing a suit? Oh, no. No, no, no. You see, if you don't wear a dress, how do we know you're lady? How do we know? Jada Pinkett Smith reveals that she and Will Smith have been separated for seven years. I don't fucking care. I don't think Will knew, though. Just her. This guy says India's work culture must change. Youngsters should work 70 hours a week. Why don't you work 70 hours a week? Why don't you get back on the fucking line and work 70 hours a week, asshole? Yes. Impeach him for the crime of walking on the beach. He should be impeached. The world burns and he walks on the beach. American hostages be damned. Yeah, but the guy that played golf 50 fucking hours a day wasn't the problem. Trying to find chaos when there's no reason to. My tenant continually submits rent payment on the fifth of the month. The lease does offer a five-day grace period. What's the best way to handle this situation? <laughs> Let me get this straight. The tenant pays. The tenant pays the full amount. The tenant pays the full amount within the period allowed by the lease. All correct, yes. Then what should you do? Cash the check, say thank you for being an outstanding tenant, and stop complaining. Yeah, holy crap. What a pathetic goddamn question to ask. How can I screw this <laughs> toll over who completely abides by the rules of our lease and pays everything on time in full? Hmm. Can I kill him or something? F <laughs> landlords, dude. While American YouTuber MrBeast's goal was to provide clean drinking water for 500,000 people, activists say his actions shamed the Kenyan government and helped perpetuate the stereotype that Africa's dependent on handouts. <laughs> I heard a lot of people retorting at Yahoo News about this, like, yeah, doesn't the Kenyan government need a little bit of shaming just at this point, them specifically? <laughs> oh, man. See, 
I understand some certain points about the type of content that he creates, but he's doing at least a little bit of what I wished everybody with infinite goddamn money would do. Anything! Build some libraries, help some people out, do something that affects not millionaire billionaires in a good way. You know, people like Elon Musk have the ability to fix so many problems so fast just by dumping their infinite goddamn money on things. And look, I've already ranted about, oh, he doesn't have liquid wealth. Like, yeah, he does when he wants to buy fucking <laughs> Twitter. Sure, those people can help a lot. This guy is nowhere near those people's net worth, and he's doing more than they can <laughs> ever have, man. Mental health care is health care, Mr. President. That's why it has no place in public schools. What? Mental health care is health care. That's why I'm proud to have released a new national strategy to, I'm sure you did. Read what you wrote here. Yes, health care has no place in public schools. I'm confused. They felt vulnerable and victimized by children's artwork. Hospital removes Gaza artwork from Hospital Corridor. We're delighted to report that Chelsea and Westminster Hospital has removed the display of artwork designed by children from... We're moving on. Fucking <laughs> A. When a car is affordable housing. Dozens of parking lots have opened across the U.S. for working people who earn too little to afford rent, but too much to receive government assistance and have turned their cars into a form of affordable housing. <laughs> Dozens of parking lots of... How much do you have to pay to park there? There's always an opportunistic little do you have I'm guessing you have a nightly goddamn fee what's that 20 bucks a night or something like that yeah yeah that's great now well, it is wild to think there are approximately 2 billion parking spots in the US Oh, man. Wonder how many of them sit empty all the time. Oh, shit, tons of them. So Mike Johnson adopted his 14-year-old black son when he was 25 and unmarried. Matt Gates adopted a 14-year-old Cuban immigrant named Nestor when he was 30 and unmarried. Both are powerful Republicans now in the House. Can anyone help me understand what's going on here? Dude, I don't fucking know. That's not why I took this job. Not to know things. It's fun that some folks think a secret group of rich people control everything instead of a widely known known group of rich people that control everything. <laughs> it's not secret. There is no Illuminati out there, folks. They are in the open because they know there's nothing we can do for now, or nothing we will do for now. Should I be concerned about my relationship? My 39 male girlfriend, 26 female, is about to start chemo in a few weeks. I know our sex life is going to change. Oh, here we go. Yeah, so they're going through chemo. They've got cancer, and you're just thinking about <laughs> hmm. Why don't you go jerk off into a towel like I hope you have to do for the rest of your life. I get that it's not her fault, but sex is a very big part of our relationship. Right now, it's not. I try not to stress her out, but I want to be honest and <laughs> it's going to be seven months or so, and I'm nervous we're not going to make it. <clears throat> that is completely and 100% your own fault and your own problem. You know, I've always found you immensely physically attractive, but with your disability, it's like you're only half a man to me. I don't know, it sounds rude. You weigh almost 250 pounds. It's like you're actually two and a half women to me. I don't know, it sounds rude. You're the biggest ass. What? What's his disability? You know what? It doesn't matter. That was a gross statement. Wisconsin high school cheerleaders received awards for biggest breasts, but at banquet. High school? Wow. We should... <sighs> Just f***ing wow. Ben finds out his friends don't care about his feelings. Benini Shabibo throws a fit after Tuckle Cuckleson suggests Americans should be more concerned with the 100,000 annual OD deaths in the U.S. than the 500 foreigners who died 7,000 miles away. He's not concerned about any of those things. Mom shares colorful travel hack to keep toddlers quiet on flights. Destroy the sh that you're flying in. I know that drawing on the wall doesn't destroy it. I, I get it. It's a joke. Calm the f*** down. My frustration with young people is that they think success is supposed to happen like that. She's full of sh Young people don't expect for things to happen like that. They expect to at least be able to find a job after graduating and being $80,000 in debt, not having to move back in with their parents, not having insurance, not having any foreseeable chance of retiring. Yeah, but unfortunately, like most billionaires, Oprah forgot where the f*** she started, absolutely forgot that she was not always one of the richest women in the world. And yeah, sure, 
it's it's just it's just so sad, dude. How do you come from nothing, right? How do you actually climb out of that hole and then have such shitty <laughs> statements like that? No, young people are not fucking <laughs> stupid like you all like to pretend. We got absolutely reamed. All right. What I always hear: we can't afford to pay our workers fifteen dollars an hour. What I never hear: we can't afford to pay our CEO millions of dollars a year. I don't think there's ever been a CEO worth as much as they're often paid ever. And you know what? Unfortunately, at this point, the 15 bucks an hour is useless. Sure, it's a little more, for sure, especially over federal minimum wage and whatnot, but it's not enough to fucking live anywhere still. That's kind of what we're trying to go for. Unless we put limits on corporations buying single-family houses, 90% of us are going to end up as lifelong renters, and the U.S. will be one giant network of Pottersvilles. I don't know what that is, but yeah, how have we not made this illegal yet? A corporation's not a person, it's not a family, it does not deserve housing because it's not a living entity. It's just a group of arrogant douchebags stealing as much as they can from everybody else and providing the worst fucking products of all time, nine times out of ten. Sniper Wolf just doxed me on her Instagram. Creepy, gross, violating. What you do is disgusting. You steal content and stalk YouTubers. Demonetize this dangerous creator or just get her off of your platform. She posted on Instagram right outside of our home and then deleted it. Yeah, that whole situation is still pathetic to me. It sucks that I heard that even if Jack did pursue some legal action, as he should be able to, he probably would not win that. That was just something I read. That may not be the case. I hope that's not the case. I hope he is able to sue and absolutely annihilate in this case. I've known Jack for quite some time, and he does not deserve to now be considering f***ing moving from the home that he has been in for a long time. That is pathetic, and Sniper Wolf yikes, man. Just yikes. In 2022, 88-year-old Ida, I'm not gonna mispronounce your last name, died after nurses accidentally injected chicken soup into her veins instead of her feeding tube. <laughs> How do you accidentally do that? I'd like to know. Democrats think prison will stop Trump, but after he wins and pardons himself, you'll have this to deal with. Tim, you are so gay. <laughs> and I don't mean homosexual. <laughs> <laughs> that is... Oh, dude. Did he really post this? <laughs> I know the guy's a dip... <clears throat> Did he really post this? <laughs> Oh, dude. This man is our speaker, Mike Johnson, on his wife Kelly not being in attendance for his ascension to House Speaker. She spent the last couple of weeks on her knees in prayer to the Lord, and um, she's a little worn out. Okay, dude. <laughs> uh, cool. Isn't this the guy who checks his son's p usage? And his son also monitors his? I mean, I, I don't know. You read some weird stuff on the internet, man. Warner Bros. never fired Amber Heard from Aquaman 2 because her former boyfriend, Elon Musk, Musk had one of his litigators send a scorched earth letter threatening to burn the house down if the actress wasn't brought back for a sequel, says a source. What was he gonna do? I'm not kidding. What was he going to be able to do? See, these motherfuckers <laughs> like to pretend like billionaires are, well, they picked themselves up by their bootstraps and, you know, they just worked really hard on the farm and, like, dude, no. Look at that sh <laughs> He clearly knows he has the ability to do something, and the threat apparently worked. So, no, these aren't regular <laughs> people. They did not pick themselves up by their bootstraps. Look at this dude. How do you threaten Warner Brothers with the most vague shit I've ever seen and have it work? Harvard is named worst school for free speech, scoring zero out of a possible 100. Okay. My girlfriend is currently crying because she thought the $70 she wanted to spend on adopting a koala bear from the Australian brush fires was actually going to physically get her a koala bear. Like they would just FedEx that to us and not just her become a sponsor. That's kind of weird that she would think she would get a f***ing koala bear, or koala, whatever. I know they're not bears. That's probably the weakest argument I've heard, defending a healthcare system that kills 50,000 people a year. 50,000 people a year? Show me well-researched statistics. That's 45,000 lol, you're stupid, you're f***ing stupid. My third grader came home with this today from school, excited to show me how he'd written his name in Chinese. I had to gently explain to him that this, um, is extremely not correct? Doctor doesn't know what skin-to-skin -skin contact is. <laughs> Uh, men cannot breastfeed. You can put your shirts on now and call the mother. These men are not attempting to breastfeed. They're engaging in skin-to-skin -skin contact, a practice proven to be beneficial for newborns. 
Yes, it is proven. I'm so tired of this particular thing. Everybody is hitting <clears throat> on new dads who are there, they're excited, they're happy because, oh, well, you cried when your son was born? <clears throat> You're such a <clears throat> loser. Quit acting like a woman. Why are you? Put your shirt on. That's so fucking <clears throat> gross and weird and creepy. Like, no, no. You're just jealous they had sex. This is so stupid. This is how women should dress at the gym. See, ladies, it's not hard. You can do it, too. Believe in yourself and stop being a whore. Shut the actual f*** up. True story. Harvard Business School rejected me in 91. When I got the news, I checked to see if they'd cashed my $100 application fee check. They hadn't. So I did a stop payment. When they called trying to collect, I suggested they could learn a business lesson from this. Yeah, what are they gonna do? Not let you into the school? Oh! oh Mamma mia! Incredibly proud to have voiced Mario and Luigi in Super Mario Bros. Wonder. Thanks to Nintendo for inviting me into the Flower Kingdom. Great. A pronoun person is now Mario. What the hell? Screw that. Get the OG back. No pronoun people in my Nintendo. <laughs> Oh, oh, it must be such a tortured existence being that pathetic. So sad. Math is hard. I mean, yeah, that's correct. That is not how, nor has it even been how parentheses work. By your logic, I don't, I don't care. It's not that he gets it wrong. It's how sure he is. I went out and surveyed my town for worker shortages. Jobs paying $30 an hour or more, no shortage. 25 to 30, no shortage. 20 to 25, no shortage. 15 to 20, a couple help wanted signs. Jobs paying less than $15 an hour, shortage. Now, if only there was a solution. I've said it before, I'll say it again. If you work a job at all, you deserve to live. You deserve food, water, shelter. You deserve a life, you do. And if the business you're working for cannot afford to operate and make sure that you, as one of its employees, can live, they do not deserve to be in business, and that's all there is to it. Group of ladies make a list of places men shouldn't take them on the first date. So why is Cheesecake Factory at the top of this list, though? Can we can we ask about that? <clears throat> because the Cheesecake Factory is, I don't know, it's fine. It's expensive. There's a lot to choose from. It's fine. But why is the Cheesecake Factory a worse first date than Applebee's? No, I'm serious. Any fast food chain, <clears throat> fuck it, we go on a Taco Bell. Like, I love this. Every, what do you do? I'm not kidding. What do you do? Because all the, the 28 things right here, all I could think of, man. What do you do? A bar for just drinks. <clears throat> what do you want? What is it you want? <laughs> Wikipedia is not for sale. I will give them a billion dollars if they change their name to <clears throat> Wikipedia. You know what? They absolutely should have taken him up on that. You know he wouldn't have paid, but he's, he's done this game before. I will give you this much money if you do this. They do it. Nuh-uh. I won't. But they should absolutely take him up on that offer. Change the name. Once the check clears, change it back because he clearly did not outline a specific amount of time. He didn't say permanently. He didn't say that at all. So screw that guy. I have a date with a guy this weekend and he asked me what my budget was so he could pick a nice restaurant for us. Budget? Am I paying for my meal? Yeah. Yeah, that's kind of how this works. There's nothing wrong with, you know, being the guy and paying for everything. You know, being the gentleman. There's nothing wrong with that. But there's also nothing wrong with not doing that because y'all are both adults. And there you go. Oh, hey, it's Dean Browning, who is uh, a black gay guy. And he can personally say that Obama did nothing for him. <laughs> Forgot to switch accounts, pal. Daily active users on mobile apps globally change from October of 2022. Snapchat, Instagram, YouTube, TikTok, Fa Snapchat's that high? Damn. I mean, I use it, but I thought most people were starting to abandon it. X, formerly Twitter. It was not formerly Twitter. It is Twitter. Also, I read somewhere that the valuation of the company went from 44 billion right before Musky Boy, and it's now valued at 19. The dude is a business genius. Masterful gambit, sir. Yes. 